Hey guys, Jeremy here, and guess what? The undergrads Kickstarter has begun. I am so excited about this. The reason why I've got my mouse in my hand is because I'm going through all the pledges. Now, admittedly, the rewards are actually pretty cool. I admit that I'm actually down for a lot of them. I love the fact that uh, one of them is you get Rocco's fake ID. That's a great one for $20. I did. I'm going to probably do multiple <laughs> because the pledge I've got right now is $30 for the one of the movie posters which is something I definitely want because obviously I want to add it to the wall here now the only thing I've kind of run into a, a issue with for me is I realize that you can only do one pledge as one person so I have to make multiple accounts because <laughs> I want to give multiple monies to this thing multiple monies Wow I'm tired there's a lot of really cool uh, prizes and rewards here and one of them being $40 for an undergrads t-shirt, $50 for the digital download, which admittedly brings up a question though. Is it only the people who get the digital download who pay for that get the movie? So what about the other people? How is this movie going to be distributed? This is obviously just for the pre-production. This is something that is a starter. That's why the goal is only 115,000 because that's something to get it going to get producers interested. I think that Pete was right to do that. Pete was like he's thinking of it in stages. This is something that obviously is a big idea of animation and he's taking the right course with this. But like I said, what do the other people get to? Is it only if you do the digital download to get the movie? So this is something that's gonna have to kind of be explained because I don't know if this movie will get a theatrical distribution. If it did, that'd be super, super dope. I don't think it will. I think it's just gonna be a straight DVD sort of affair, kind of like Blue Mountain State was. But still, it would be interesting. But there's other pledges here too. Uh, what I really want, but I wanna, I'm gonna kind of wait until, I might be waiting until I talk to Pete on my radio show this Saturday, but mind you, I don't even know if I'm going to have the time because this thing already got $36,000 in t less than 24 hours and the goal is $115,000. So we're already more than 20% of the way there, which is awesome because at first when I was looking at the math and just seeing how it was overnight, I was like, mm, maybe it might struggle its way there, but I have a good feeling that it's going to make it there, especially because I'm going to give it more money. I'm going to tell my friends to give it money people who are big fans of this show. Uh, then there's $100 for the Alpha Alpha Forever thing. Uh, have your names in the credits guy. Uh, a voicemail. Now I would love to get a voicemail. This voicemail is awesome. For $200 you can get a voicemail from Nitz, Gimpy, Cal, or Rocco. It's like one of them. Not all four, just one of them. And I would love it if I didn't have a business. If I didn't have a <laughs> photography business. I'd love to get a Rocco one be so bad. $500 you get to be a background character, uh, $1,000 you get to go to the screening. Mind you, the screening does not include flight and hotel accommodation, so keep that in mind for those of you who have not bought it. No one's bought it yet. To $2,500 for associate producer, and then uh, $3,500 for your name to be mentioned in some way or form. Uh, along with all this uh, thing. Oh, this is a standalone. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Uh, and then 75,000, you get to be a part of the gang. You were animated in, and I think they even do your voice. Yeah, your voice is in it too. And that's for 7,500. If I... Wow. Two... It's been claimed. Damn, that's how it jumped up so much last night. He got $15,000 overnight from two people. If I had the money, I would have bought that. If I had the money, I would have definitely bought that. I was surprised no one's at the screening. Like, someone jumped right for the most expensive thing on this list. Like, the other three haven't been touched, but that's crazy. I'm definitely going to do the poster. I'm definitely going to do the t-shirt. I'm probably gonna do the digital download. I want to do the hat too. I want to do the Nitz's hat. I'd love to do that. The only thing I'm just a little bit concerned about, not nothing to do with Pete, it's more so just my experience with getting hats from different contests before is the hats are usually shit. Like really shitty. Like they're made for a six year old or something. Like my, admittedly, hats don't fit my head very well. I've got a big ass melon. So <laughs> that's why I'm kind of concerned about that. So I might, wait but i don't know like if the kickstarter has already gone past its limit does that mean i wouldn't be able to get it i don't know anyways that's all for me guys check it out i'm going to leave a link in the description below 
please pledge money. For If you were a fan of undergrads, this is something that's going to be a fantastic reunion of these characters. I'm really looking forward to seeing these guys back on uh, back on the big screen. Well, on the TV screen. If they got on the big screen, that'd be cool. But anyways, that's all from me. I hope you enjoyed this little video. And like I said, please donate if you were a fan of undergrads and you want to see it come back. That's all from me, guys. Hope you liked the video. If you did, leave a like. And if you're interested in more, maybe subscribe. Anyways, that's all from me. See you next time.